And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary, as always, is Lee Dixon. And what we have to look forward to is action from Ligue 2. What a match this promises to be, Lee. Yeah, thank you, Derek. Real pleasure to be here. Looking forward to this game. Players will be a bit nervous. I was always nervous at the start of games. It's important you get your first pass off to your colleague, maybe get a good tackle in, settle the nerves down. Looking forward to a good game here. And so the lineup for Toulouse. The wing backs are going to be crucial in this setup. You've played in that position, Lee. Yeah, I didn't really like it. And we always thought when we were playing against five at the back with the wing backs exposed like this in this formation, that a 4 4 2 can really create a 2v1 down the side. So keep your eye out for that. And the three narrow midfield players supply the support for the two forwards up front. This is how the visitors will set up today. Fairly conventional 4-5-1 setup. Yeah, that back four will be protected throughout the game with the five midfield players in front of them. Really important that they do support that lone striker when they do have the ball. Merci. Bon match à toutes et à tous. And so the battle commences. Vakun Bayo. De Jagere. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. Amiot. De Jagere. Now moving the ball impressively here. Vakun Bayo. Excellent defending. Ba. Dylan Luiser. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. And intercepts again. Vakun Bayo. Gabrielson. Machado. Gabrielson. Oh, he's given the ball away. Oh, he's given it away. Bayo. Vakun Bayo. Bayo. I must say, this looks promising. 
Well, Toulouse certainly enjoying the lion's share of possession, but really, possession doesn't score your goals. You need to be a little bit more forceful in front of goal. They need to get their shots away. And the ball's gone. Dylan Luiser. Bar. Olivier Kemen. Luiser. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Dylan Luiser. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. And snuffing out the danger. Isuf Paro came in. A possession lost, intercepted. Over the touchline for a throw in. Time for a change then. Yasin Buran. A sa place, le numéro 10, Valentin Jacob. De Jagere. Amio Moreira Now well, they keep working away looking for passing lanes Intercepting it intelligently Danger averted Well, Derek, there's nothing between these two teams in terms of possession. Can someone take control of this game? Take a few more risks. Hopefully we'll see a goal soon. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Real chance. A goal it is. At long last, they've broken the deadlock. Well, it's been so close this game. Tactics have played a part. Now they're going to have to change the tactics and see what happens. Well, here's the replay, and in many ways, it doesn't do it justice how patient they were in the build-up. And then the composer is impressive as he smashes the ball with all he has to beat a forlorn goalkeeper. Brilliant strike.
Substitution time it is. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Bayo. David Machado. Well, they keep working away, looking for an opening. Credit to them for winning back possession. Paro. Isuf Paro. Luis Serre. Olivier Kemen. Well, with five minutes remaining and just one goal between them, still the prospect of late excitement. This could finish it! And the keeper got there. Well, having been awarded the corner, they'll no doubt look to put the issue beyond all doubt. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. And he's fired over the corner. Well, the keeper very decisive. Growing pressure here and another corner. Over it comes. The end product just wasn't there. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. And giving the ball away. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. Well, the body language is there for all to see. Fine lines between success and failure in this game we all love. Not today for them, but I'm sure they'll bounce back next. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance this evening, Lee. He's always a man to watch for the opposition, but they couldn't keep tabs on him in that vital moment when he grabbed that goal.